Hey guys, welcome to our YouTube channel. I hope everybody enjoys this video. We're gonna go find us some morel mushrooms. Uh, supposed to be a beautiful day today, it's 80 degrees. It's Sunday. Well, it's about 10, 11 o'clock here in southeastern Kentucky, but uh, looking kind of raining stormy back that way. And it's not 80 degrees, it's about 58 degrees. So. I think we'll have better luck today than we've been having. Let's go see, guys. We might find some morels. All right, guys, we back there and blow the house at the walnut tree where I was at the other day. It's windy, and it's looking stormy back in there. But Mama said they'd give them 80 degrees. We just had our devotional time. I told Mama, I said, for church, I'm gonna go down there and see if I can find some morels, or at least before it rains again, or dry land fish. I'm talking proper now, we call them dry land fish. They should be up, but now they're going to be. Yeah, I see one from here, guys. I already spot one. I already spot one. He's a little feller. Let's see if I find him on camera here. Right there he is. I already spot one. Let's check to see Dylan. Boy, he ain't much, is he? They was in here last year, that's one. See if we can find some more, guys. Uh, I'll pause it for a second, see if I can find another. Guys, y'all gonna have to help me look here. There's just, <laughs> they gotta be bigger than that, I can't spot them. I wanna find them old big ones. I spot another one, guys, just as I turn the camera back on. He's a tiny little dude. You see him here? Yep, there he is. Pinch him off right top of the ground. What's this gonna take me a while? Get a mess that size, guys. Why they don't grow no bigger than that? That's about what we found here last year. We found a few pretty, I mean, you know, middle sized ones in here. That's two. Alrighty, guys. There are a few up now. Spread it around through here. Finally, we're getting something successful on camera. Alright, guys, hold on. Let's see if we. Find another there in a minute. Right around the roots of this tree where we found some of it last year. Well, that's one find them at this year too, but they gotta be some bigger ones than that in here. They ain't no real big ones where I can see them. Let's keep a look at that. Two, at least it ain't a, it's the only place I know to look. I think I see another one. I do, it's a little bitty fella though. Don't you look here how little this dude is. Uh-oh, that's a little fella. We'll count him, though. There's three. They are morel, but they're small. Oh, I see a better one. See if y'all spot him. I do right there. And four. I was thinking it might have been above this tree where we found all the pretty ones that last year. Now, this is getting a little better here now. I don't think they grow in after they come up because these are done turning. They're done turning their brown color to I don't know if they do or not. Four. I broke the stem off that little high. Not nothing to brag about. Let's, they say they're seeds up there. We'll shake them out if they are. Get them to come back up next year. That's four. Let's see what we can keep a finding in here. Yeah, if watch them little fellas, you step on them. Hey, I see one even better. Even better than that, I believe. Make me five. You see him, guys? Right there. Right there he is. Boy, ain't these little fellers. I see another one. Might be six, I think. Ain't these little fellers. I don't know if there's anything to that, but they are because they over in, in uh, Mammoth Cave, they make you pack a uh, uh, Brillo bag where that seed to fall out. So we'll shake them out good. I see another one somewhere. If I don't lose this, like Jen sang and find a bunch of sang, turn your head away from it and not be able to find it back. But I see it. It's right here. I think this has been up for a while. This one makes number six. I probably overlooked it the other day when I was down here. Yeah, I tell you, yeah, I overlooked it the other day when I was there. It's number six. Now, my morel hunting are awful small. I mean, they used to be some mushrooms in this country. Or dry land fish, what we call them, but I 
I tell you, you just don't find them like you used to. I like going to Kansas and places where they got them old big and Missouri and places. I like to watch videos on YouTube. Up north, too, they find big ones. Let's keep looking. I think we're up to six. They probably are 20 around here if you just see them. They're so small. I don't even be able to get enough for a taste like it. Take 50 of them. Oh, I see a better one. I see two more. I'm about to step on them here. They're a little better, too. There's just one. There's one. That's a little better. Up here's the other one. Uh oh, two more up here. Never mind. That was seven, wasn't it? Eight. Yeah, that's a little better there. Nine. Yeah, that's a little better. Well, that there ain't, but that two there was pretty good. Right. Ooh, that wind's cold. We almost 80 degree weather predictions off a little bit. We don't lose them out of my bag here. All right, guys, I'm gonna pause you for a minute. Uh, oh, no, wait a minute, I hear you. I found another one right here. I, got, no, I found another. Two more. It should be somewhere around 10. We'll count them here in a little bit. See what we're at. Did I show you that? Yep. Little fella. Been right here. Got another little bitty fella. And they just ain't much. I pulled him up our roots too. Let's break a little bit of that off. Put him back down there. About what we found there. Maybe a little better last year than this. But they weren't none big ones. But now I'll pause it till I find some more. So it won't take up as much camera time. And y'all listen at me yak. I love to find dry land fish. I love to eat them too. There's so much garbage washed in here over the. Just washed all that down in here. It's probably covered up a lot of them. Oh, I about stepped on a big one right here. Not a big one. Big one than what I've been finding. It's covered up a lot of them. I didn't even see this one turn turn until I turned the camera on. It's good luck turning the camera on. It's either 11 or 12. Let's see if y'all see. Let's see if I can get him on camera. Where's he at? Right there he is. Let's have him look down and see him standing there. Uh, he's, he's not bad. It's hard to pick one of that small. Let me check the seeds out just in case. Just in case. But all this stuff is washed down in here. It kind of may have covered them up. I mean, you know, you see what I'm talking about? I'd like to find some big ones. Hold on a minute, guys. I'll bring it to you if I do. It's like every time I turn the camera back on, I find one. My oldest aunt in Somerset, her brother-in-law and sister-in-law live beside her. They have for years, probably 40 years or longer. And their yard, her brother-in-law's yard, which they passed away now. Yeah, see, I told you right here, I found another one. Quick, so turn the camera back on. I hear he's getting white. Hey, boy, he got the stem. He just ain't got no, look him over. They just ain't got no body size to him. I've lost count now. We'll have to recount when we get up here. Their yard just got pine trees. Well, he's got apple trees in it. But it's in the middle of Somerset, in the middle of the city. I don't know in the last few years, but you used to go up there, and my uncle, before he passed away, would go over and he'd literally get a grocery bag full out of their yard every year. Just, they weren't big, big ones, but they was, you know, dry land fish, at least. And, uh, they just grown out in the yard. This year it's been dozed, it's been dozed off, cleaned off. But usually around walnuts is where they're at. And North Hill, and there's a small in here. Man, overlook them easy. That's about the way they was in here last year. I believe I found a little better ones in here last year. They're awful small this year. Alrighty, guys. I'm bringing to tell you if I find another Every time I turn the camera on, I find one. So let's turn it back off a little while. Alrighty guys, found another one. He's been up for a while, but right there he is. Shake him out there, he'll still eat. Well, he's still around that little walnut right there. There's a doggone little, guys. 
I can't hardly see them, but the kids come down here and helped me last year, but they shrunk down more than we found. Really, I found some that they, they were so small. I mean, you back I get down on your hand, knees, and crawl right away where we find them that while ago, right over in there. Y'all probably see some and I won't even get them. My eyes is not as good as it used to be. They're pretty good this morning, though. All right, guys, I'm going to pause you, see if I can find another. I found some down in here last year on down here. And it's popular, not many, but I found a few scattered along out there. Yeah, them so small, though. They're not even hardly worth gathering, are they? Yeah, I do. I just found another. See, every time I turn that camera on, guys, I find one. I'm moving on over the heat one. That is just so weird. <laughs> I'm going to turn it back off. I catch you in a minute, see? Every time I turn the camera on, I find one. That's no joke. As I was getting ready to say, I'll turn it back on now. Maybe I'll find another. As I'm moving on over the hill here last year, I found a few, not many, further got away from the walnut tree less to found. But ain't these little fellers. I don't know why they don't grow no bigger. Let's see if we can find some more. See, like every time I turn the camera on, I find one, but... Hey guys, I'll pause you back, bring you back if I find one. That old grizzly skull can laying on the ground keeps drawing me back to it. I must have found some around it last year. I know I did. Which I did find it one right below it this year too. Alrighty guys, I ain't found no more. But maybe I'll get a taste. Alright guys, I'll pause you see if we find any more. Guys, we're getting way down in, down in the hot, well, not way down in the hot, but I don't know if this is another walnut tree down here or what. If it is, I didn't look around now last, last year. But I'll tell you a short story. Uh, my brother come in with a couple about the size of these I'm finding in his hand. He'd been on four water one time. We lived out on the farm. He'd come in. He'd be up on the strip mine pits, where it used to be strip mines, coal mines, and come back and he said, ain't these dry fish? I said, yeah, where'd you find them at? So I got on board. I went back where he found them. Yeah, I see one from here. <laughs> where he found them at. And here's one guy. Maybe they could a little better down in here. Yeah, I see one other one from here. Up on the bank area. Yeah, these are a little better down here. I guess maybe this has to take his time really looking this holler. It may be full of little. And they was like this. And he took me back to that place. I'll keep the camera on that the first if y'all spot it. I see it. It ain't too big, but, and uh, it was just where the dozers, where they made the strip mines. Oh, I see two. I see two more good ones. And uh, where they dozed up on the strip mines and pushed up a big dirt pile. And up on top of that dirt pile, I think it was 150 little bitchins was standing around on top of that pile and around the edge of the pile and around the edge of the woods around it. And they was all little like this. And this and these are the smallest ones I ever found in the area. But now I never come down this far last year, but right here stands two sweetens compared to what I'm catching or getting today. Not catching what I'm finding. What did I find them in? I know I'm throwing the camera every way, but right here's one of them. They kind of eat that size. Yeah, that ain't too bad. There's another in here ain't too bad either. What did I see him at? He was standing right here on the bank. I'd been standing there talking to him. Now I'll never find him again. Well, yeah, right here he is. That's how bad my eyes is. He's standing right here. Bet you all seen him. See, I just seen one when I looked up here. I seen this little one. I didn't see that big one standing nowhere. That's why I always was ginseng. I'd usually find one bunch and get looking around and be standing there. Well, but, uh, uh, I've got a little handful so far. I might get enough to get a taste. But now I never come down this far last year. They even look because they were so little up there. I don't know. I, just, I don't think I'd come down this far. But now we know we found two blow up big cherries. So guys, remember that next year. Or did we find three here? I can't remember. Maybe more. Keep looking around. That sun's getting out in here. I think I need to give it another visit in a day or two. This may be just the first one coming up. I don't know. 
But now they never did get no, they never did get no bigger last year down here. They pushed a lot of junk over this holler when they dug this place up here. I'll put you on pause until I find another one. If I do. I don't know if that's a walnut or cottonwood. I don't for sure. But it's a walnut. You see where they doze it in time. They doze those stuff down in these old hollers. They dozed up to down here in this old holler place right here. Almost makes it look like an old house place, but it's not. I figured it might be some down in here, though. Never know. We'll keep a looking. Maybe. Let's see he's on down here, then we'll ease back up the holler here. Look around. I know I'm gonna get in ticks. I won't get too deep down that holler too much of a walk back out. Well, no more than I'm finding. I don't know what this has been right here. But uh, they sure had dozed it up. I know that the ears like to hang out. It looks like, like what they've dozed up and buried stuff in time. I don't know. My hunting leash is around the hill there, about uh, you get to this timber where the timber ain't being cut here, you'll hit my hunting leash and it comes over here on this side. Mm. But I'm not doing much. I'm coming down in the holler too. It don't look steep, but it is. I don't know. It just like what it pushed up with a dozer here. I don't know. I wouldn't think a concrete block and everything. I wouldn't think there would have been a house down in here. Here, slabs of concrete. All right, guys, if I find one, I'll bring it to you. All right, guys. Let's see if we find any up through here. We come back up out of there. I didn't see nothing over in there. Sun don't hit too good in here. It just don't hit in here. Right there's a be the. It's 10, 11 o'clock, so I don't know for sure what time it is, but Eastern time. That'd be east. West be behind me. I guess the sun's coming up in the east now. It changes a little bit in the winter. I don't know how that works, actually. All right, guys, I'll put you on pause, see if we find anything. Now, was it not blow the cherry trees? Let me go where I found them last in there. I'm thinking the solar sun's kind of hitting in here, too, a little better. I'd say if you combed all the way, all the way around through up in here, there's probably one or two here and there, but they're so doggone little. It'd be, take a month of Sundays to get a bite. That's about all I've got a bite. I've probably got 10 or 12, I don't know, 15, I found. And that's about all i got to taste. <laughs> oh, well. Oh, was it around that one? I don't remember. I thought I found something like around this cherry tree. Then I went on down around the one. I did. I don't see no more. There was two pretty ones here. I think I done that last year down in here. The same thing. If I got over the hill, less I fell. <clears throat> uh, I'll put her back on pause. See, well, the first every time I don't pause it, I'd find a mushroom or dry land fish. And now it's getting a little colder. We'll run back up here and overlook this one place again. See if there's any more little beatings I've overlooked. Oh, yeah. Look here what I walked over when I was up here the other time. See, I told you, it's a little best than I found all day long. Right there. And I was all over this, because there's the walnut tree. They shake him out good. I know he just didn't come up. I just didn't see him. He might get enough to get a taste. Anyway. I they're awful small in here. <laughs> Should be, I like finding them big ones when I was a kid, man. We used to find them big as we fist or more big white ones. You just spot them standing up on the banks. These have got a decent color to them. They're just little. I don't know. The reason I know they's in here, neighbors up there told me, somebody, their daughter or somebody used to come down here and just find them by the bag fools. Used to years ago. A dollar and a friend or something, but they didn't. Well, they didn't eat them, so 
She said she didn't know if there'd be any more down here or not. I come down here last year and found a few, like I did this year. Of course, it ain't far from the house. But those trailer. I can't believe I left that big, would have left that big pretty one standing there. And if you go and watch when you get finding like little bunches of ginseng, in my eyes, a lot of times I'd overlook big things. If you get looking for big ginseng, you overlook little ginseng. I'll be the same way with these mushrooms. But we've got an apple tree and a peach tree. we got two apple trees and a peach tree up under the yard. And I've mowed, which Mama wanted to mow good this year, so I put her about 150 pound fertilizer, triple 19 fertilizer on the yard, so I'm saying she's going to get the mow some. I don't know if that hurt them or not. But that one thing that hurt us in here this year is all the stuff washed down in here. It's, it's took up a lot of the room. I'm just not seeing them like I was. I pause the camera and bring it back. Every time I bring it back, I've got a, I've got one. So mama's yard is going to be awful green. I fertilized. I don't know. Right here's a little apple tree. Don't hurt to look. I ain't found no more. Look at these apple trees. What we going in? That's a, yeah, it's no, they're pear trees. I'm sorry. They're not apple trees. What am I thinking? I don't see nothing. All right, guys. All right, guys. We got 18, best I can count. Thanks for watching. And uh, if you ain't already, please like and subscribe to our channel. And may God bless each and every one of these. Catch you on the next video.